Hello. I realise that making videos is going to be tough, so I do hope I get better at this. It's been a tough day. Um, I came back from a funeral today. It is the fourth person that um, died of cancer this year, where I was shattered because it, um, it was so unnecessary. And it really makes you wonder um, what we are led to believe, what keeps us healthy, and what the food industry, what the advertising tells us to eat. It just, it's just mind boggling. And as long as governments don't control advertising and what is allowed to be written, I don't think we have much hope in hell. So I want to bust some myths that are out there um, there are many of them, and sometimes I really don't know where to start. I'll start with an easy one, bread. Now we all love bread. Well, I particularly love bread because I'm German and uh, I grew up with the real bread with substance where you could really get your teeth into. Now we have come a long way with our bread over the years. Sourdough has really become very popular. I have to tell you something that you may not want to know, but um, a lot of the sour bread that you will find in supermarkets or in conventional um, stores is not real sourdough, it's actually synthetic. It's a liquid and I've seen it and I've smelled it and I've discarded it. I wanted to bake my own bread and I thought I'd take a shortcut uh, with um, sourdough. So I went to a bakery which specializes in sourdough bread. And I asked whether I could have some. And he says, yeah, sure. He said, did you bring a container? Oh, no, I was a bit puzzled. And he said, oh, never mind. I have something here, I can put it in. So he disappeared in the back and I looked around the corner. There's this big 10 gallon, I don't know how many gallons in there, big drum. And he scooped out this dish of liquid and put it in that container and um, and gave it to me. And I said, oh, how much do I owe you? And he said, no, let's forget, let's forget it. It's okay. So I put it in the car, drove home, opened it up, and I smelt it. And I looked at it and I thought, oh, my God, it looked like vomit, really. And it smelled like it. So it is not... A cultured sourdough if you really want to buy a cultured sourdough be prepared to pay at least six to seven dollars for a bread anything below that unless it's a day old well, there's nothing wrong with that because sourdough the co real conventional sourdough bread normally tastes better the next day um, so yeah you know, when I ate the sourdough bread from the supermarket I was wondering like I got a bit of a heartburn and it's that acidity which I couldn't take so I really knew there was something wrong so if you're a lover of bread um, look around and to really make sure that it's cultured sourdough and not the liquid form um, but with bread you know unfortunately um, our flour has been genetically modified so we have a higher gluten in it now and um, it hasn't got the nutritional value that they led us to believe when I do make my own bread I actually do the whole McCoy I, I buy the grains uh, the spelt and the rye and I mill it myself and even though I didn't have any sourdough even just using yeast it's a completely different bread and the consistency because the grain is um, is milled and it's used straight away what people don't realize is um, when you buy flour even though it's organic and it's not bleach or whatever the the germ has been removed because if you don't within maximum 12 hours that germ will taste and go rancid so you can't store it you can't store freshly ground flour you have to take out that that um, germ and so it's really not the same 
um, and to put it back in again after it's been dried or whatever it does not give you that same consistency so when you really have a chance to mill your own flour and bake it straight away you will not believe it's the same bread so um, I'd love to do it for you it's not very um, difficult it's actually flour and water and a bit of salt and a bit of oil and other than that nothing else so I hope I'm, hopefully that's been helpful um, and have a great day and keep well bye